what's up back with another video and today in this video if you have not seen the last videos i recommend you to go back and watch them up above but with that being said i'm now going to take those parts that i ordered such as the helmets the uh, um antennas and the visors and other bits and pieces to upgrade these figures in front of me in order to make them look a lot better than what they currently do um of course some of the antennas i probably won't be using because i ordered little overboard and some of these com the commando helmets from the other videos i won't be using all of them because as mentioned i realized i only had 10 and not 20 but uh let's just say 10 of both the um shadow and the white ones or regular commandos are on their way so eventually behind the scenes those will be upgraded and with that being said let's get right into this video so as you can see, these are the figures that are going to be upgraded with all these helmets and other bits and pieces in front of them in order to make them look a lot better. And yes, not all of them are going to be clones, as you can see right there with Sabine Wren um, with her season three appearance, I believe. And then these uh, stormtroopers right here, which already have their helmets off. So it'll make it a little easier to replace the helmets and it'll just be a matter of putting the helmets on. But yeah, I was just say, this Jonak Toys, yeah, he's going to get a helmet. Uh, you know, can't go with him without a helmet because his helmet's pretty cool. And then to upgrade the old Foxes I have because they have those little lines at the top. Fox is not supposed to have those um, based on all the reference material I've seen. So those helmets would be getting replaced. And the Lego one right here. But yes, they were the Lego one before, but now pretty much all have been replaced with custom parts from like Jonak and some other suppliers because that was probably the worst figure they've ever done with the Fox and I was super disappointed considering Coruscant Guard is my favorite Legion and it sucks that they messed up so bad with him but the last uh, kit I got had the just plain black um, little visor right there I'm gonna get that replaced as now the new one has white outlines instead of just being plain black and then yeah most of these guys are just a matter of replacing the helmet uh, besides, let me see here, well, a couple of these guys will get visors, or antennas at least, but here with Fordo, I'm probably going to be able to search, see if I have a strap, because he's technically always supposed to have a strap, and really, he's not supposed to have that black piece, he's just supposed to have the little red pauldron, but I'm just going to find a strap, and he'll just be, I guess, a little different than what his typical appearance is, because I already have a regular Fordo, uh, but yeah, I'll have two of him. And then going down the list, some of these helmets, I cannot find like, you know, 100% clean swaths with CAC. So their helmets would be changing a little bit. Uh, same goes with the little ARF Trooper right here. Uh, I didn't realize that they would have the design on the side, which, yeah, kind of sucks. But I'd rather just have the two or three Lego ones I have of the official version. And then just have the plain white helmets, which I'll replace those with. And yeah, with that being said, pretty much most of these guys are just matter of a helmet. But yeah, these couple of these in particular are going to have different helmets and different like visor antenna colors. And then yeah, Sabine, she's going to get a complete swap. Yeah, the body and legs are good and arms, but the helmet is pretty lackluster. And then yeah, with these guys, it's going to be kind of a change up. It's kind of going to be like the Force Unleashed. Um, version of the phase three uh clone troopers or stormtroopers i guess you can say however there's nobody that really makes like a 501st um stormtrooper design so kind of be a little i guess mix up with the uh battlefront version well not battlefront force unleashed my bad uh and then just a regular like stormtrooper commander which is like the 501st one so kind of gonna be a little change up and then i decided to get Obviously, you've seen from the other videos in orange, like, um, Lego designed, uh, pauldron. And that's just going to be the change up and make one of these guys, like, a commander of that sort. And instead of just going with the blue one, I decided to get an orange one, because that's basically how it is in Force Unleashed. Instead of just having blue and black, and I kind of want to make it a little more of a change up. So that's why I decided to do that. Uh, with that being said, I'm going to go and change all these guys up. So this is the last look of what they'll look like before. And then I'll go into showing what they look like after the upgrades and then go into a little one by one, uh, 360 degrees of the different 
upgrades I made. Of course, not all these guys are going to be shown, just be one of each variant. With that being said, now it's time to watch the time lapse of me making those changes. All right, so I finally finished putting them all together with the uh, new helmets, accessories, etc. that they needed. And yeah, just quick look through and then I'll do a 360 of each individual. Um, if there's duplicates, then I only do the one of each. So I'm not doing like eight of the same figure because that would be pointless. But yeah, I really like how they turn out usually. Um, one of those Sabines is a little crooked because the uh, legs weren't like made properly. Yeah, here's the commander. And then, yeah, just all different looks. Yeah, there's a couple of these that are a little different. So like these, for example, have different uh, waist capes that I found. So I did them a little differently. And then these two guys, yeah, those are different helmets for the wolf pack. Um, and then here, Geonosis, as you can see, if you watched the other video, I got like Waxer and Boyle's helmet for Geonosis. And then I got two of these ARF Trooper helmets. And then just moving on, Trauma, it's the same. And then, y'all, these guys are the same. There's Mayday. And then here's the Lego figure. Not so much Lego anymore. The original design was completely terrible and trash. Once again, I already kind of mentioned it earlier, but it's one of the worst designed clones, in my opinion, as they wasted all that potential all those years, and they did a complete terrible job with it. And then pretty much him, I just upgraded the helmet. But with that being said, I'm going to do a run-through and of every figure, 360 degrees, and yeah, we'll go from there and wrap up the video.
that's going to wrap up today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please subscribe down below if you're not already. And yeah, in the future, Clone Army video is for certainly coming in the near future. Um, near future, that could end up being one to two months. But yeah, I have no idea how big uh, my army will be. Once again, also these guys over here, the Stormtroopers, will add to the Imperial Collection. Um, and then the Sabines will add to the Mandalorian Collection. So I have a bunch of army videos coming here in the future. And with that being said, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out and have a great time. Bye.